Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're talking about Chris Curtis versus Mark Andre Barriut. Chris Curtis, two, two, and one in his last five fights, thirty and ten overall, minus one sixty-five favorite, thirty-six years old, five ten with a seventy-five and a half inch reach. Fighting Mark Andre Barriut, who's sixteen and six, three and two in his last five fights, two fight winning streak. Plus 140 underdog, 33 years old, did is coming off the fight with Eric Anders, where Eric Anders impressed me a lot in that matchup. Even though he lost, impressed me a lot. 6'1 with a 74 in, 74 inch reach, a couple inches taller than Chris Curtis, but also Chris Curtis has a half inch and a half inch reach advantage. Um, this fight is interesting because if you look at it, um, these are guys that fight for about 10, 10 and a half minutes, about 11, 15. Strikes landed per minute, 5.3 to 5.95 for Beirut. Striking accuracy is 50 to 47. Strikes absorb, absorbed per minute, 6.3 to 5.22 for uh, Andre, Mark andre Beirut. Defense is 54 to 53. So that's that's a little telling to me, you know. It's 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 a very slight defense. It's not much there, but takedown defense is ninety two percent to sixty seven. Very little. There's a, a, a little takedown, but he doesn't. Mark Andre Barry doesn't even average a takedown every single fight. Um, it's here and there. It's like every other fight, I would say. Now, because Chris Curtis is technically a very very good. Uh, with his takedown defense, the only one who's actually been able to take him down is uh, Narsadeen Imavov, who not don't really uh, not very high on him at all, really. But uh, <clears throat> with the style that Mark Andre Harry Barryut has, having that pressure forward, a lot of just kind of like pop shots, a lot of just dirty boxing shots. The power for sure is on Chris Curtis, but the only person to ever finish Mark Andre Barryut, you know. Who. Mar um, uh, Chitty Chitty Bang Bang was the one that was able to uh, finish him and the only person to be able to finish him. So I, I like that in Mark andre Bear Utes, um wheelhouse. I want Chris Curtis to win this, but I think the forward pressure heavy style that Bear Ute has, the output while even being heavy, I think he makes it a dog fight. And I think he wins two out of the three rounds, even though I'm going to be rooting for Chris Curtis the entire time. I like Mar Mark. I, like, I think he wins. I think this fight goes to the uh, scorecards. I don't really see a finish happening unless it's by Chris Curtis. As always, subscribe, like, comment. Let me know who you are picking down below. See you. Peace.